Hi everyone! Welcome to Crafting with Cora. Today I'm going to show you how to download a font onto your computer and use it in Design Space. So there are some differences if you're using a Mac. I'm actually going to create a video so you guys can learn how to do it on a Mac as well. So what I'm going to start by doing is opening up the popular website DaFont. There's a lot of free fonts on here and people use it quite often. Uh, just make sure that you're only using it for whatever reasons they let you. So if it's free for personal use or if it's 100% free. So what I'm going to do is download it. It's going to come out as a zip file. So I'm going to put the zip file on my computer. Double click on the zip file. And this is the file inside of the zip file. So generally a file comes in a zip format if it's too big to be downloaded. So it gets compressed into something smaller. So you just have to open it up to be able to use it. So I'm going to click on the font itself. It gives me in the different points what the font looks like. And at the top here, it gives me an install option. So I click install. As soon as the font is installed, it's going to be grayed out. So then I can just X out of here, X out of here. And I'm going to go on Cricut Design Space. And I make the window bigger so it's a lot easier to see. <clears throat> I'm going to go on New Project. And in order to be able to access your font, you actually have to create a text file. So I'm just going to write my name. And I'm going to go here. And you can type in the name of the font or you can scroll through here and find it. So this one starts with an A, so it's a lot easier to find. So I'm going to click on it here. And then my name is going to be converted to that font. So it's as simple as that. If you're trying to upload a font as your design space is already open, you won't be able to see the font. So I'll give you an example. If I click on here, I'm going to download this one here. It's called Apalu. Click on the zip file. Open up the file. Select the install button. And I'm going to close these. So it's A-P-A-L-U. So if I go back to my fonts here, I can't find it. I'm going to type it here. Nothing pops up. But if I close my design space, I'm going to say leave because we don't need to save anything we've been working on. And if I go back into design space, go into my new project, open up my text. I'm going to type my name again. And then go into my fonts. It appears now. So the reason that happens is because Design Space needs to be refreshed in order for it to work. So make sure if your Design Space is already open that you're refreshing the page up here or your refresh might be over here depending what web browser you're using. Or you can click X out of it and reopen a new window. Um, that's how the new fonts are going to be loaded. So that's it with Crafting with Cora. Thanks for checking out our video. Happy crafting!